Hey guys, welcome to our channel and in today's video we will walk through and I will show you some of the best countdown timer plugins for WordPress. We will only explore some of them in this video, however the full list is in the written blog post, definitely check it out, you have all the links to the written blog post and to the plugins themselves in the description box down below, so definitely check it out. Plugins for WP, WordPress premium plugins and themes for an affordable price. Okay, and the first plugin that we will explore called Ultimate Blocks, and this plugin will initially add many widgets to your uh, Gutenberg editor. So let's go to your WordPress website, and here under the plugins, add new, we will look for Ultimate Blocks. We can see this plugin over here, the first result on the left, we'll install it and activate it. Once activated, edit your desired page and add a Gutenberg block search for countdown and click on it to edit to your page just like so it will be added to the bottom of the page now let's click on it and here we have many options on the right to set up the plugin by default it was set to one day however we can change the date over here so let's enter a further date and we will see that it was updated to three days. You can also change the date from the calendar over here. By looking at the counter, uh, we have no need to show the weeks because the timer is only for three days. And here under this option, we can change the largest unit to days and that will eliminate the weeks just like so. So the plugin is very simple. If you want to add a class to it and design it with CSS, just expand the advanced tab and add your class over here. However, if you'd like to check the pre design template, just switch over here uh, and choose the right template, just like so. I will bring it back to the default one because I really like it and I will click on update. Once I did, I will revisit the page and make sure the plugin is looking as expected and it looks really nice. The second plugin in this list called Seedprod and that's a great plugin to beat landing pages or coming soon pages and cetera. You can install the free version, however, this free version is very limited and you will need to have the pro version of the plugin where you can get from the official website for full price. It's about $79 or cheaper based on the sale that they are running. However, you can get the exact same plugin from us for only $4.99. Exactly the same plugin, the same features. The only difference is that we don't provide technical support because we only we're distributing it, it's very easy to use and I'm sure you'll have no issues. If you have our plugin manager installed on your website, you can install it from there. Just go to our plugin manager screen, look for the plugin that you would like to install. In our case, it's Seedprod and we can install it from here by clicking on install and then on activate. Once activated, let's refresh this page and we can see the Seedprod plugin over here. It's already activated for us and all we have left to do is just to create the landing page with the, the timer and the countdown. So let's go to landing pages and here we'll click on add new landing page. Just like so, it will take us to the template library where we can choose a pre-made template to speed up the building process. This is a great idea because they are designed very well and it will save us a lot of time. I will go with this one and I will call it landing page with timer or countdown, just like so, and click on save. The visual editor will open up for us. We can see the pre-designed template, and all we have left to do is just to drag the counter widget from the left to the right into our desired position. You can drag it to any place you want. I will put it over here. Then I will click on it, and we can start set up the timer. Right now on the left side, we have all the settings that we need to have similar to the plugins I showed you earlier. Let's start by setting a different end date and we can also change the size from medium to large, just like so. The nice thing about this plugin that will allow us to change the action that will happen after the timer will run out. So we can either display a message or redirect to a different page. And if you choose the redirect, you can enter the redirect URL over here. By toggling this box, we will be able to design and change each of the parameters of the timer. For example, hours, minutes, seconds, etc. 
we can change to the template tab and just change the design uh, over all of this widget just like so and here under the advanced we can change different colors and of course border radius border colors etc when you're satisfied with the result just click on save and to view this page just go to page settings and this is the link click on this external window button and it will open it in a new page and here you can see the timer start uh, counting down to the end date the next one to explore called countdown timer ultimate you can install the free version uh, through the wordpress repository although the free version is pretty limited you still should be familiar with this plugin because it's a simple a solution simple alternative to anybody who is looking for a nice decent countdown timer once activated go to the countdown timer tab and here click on add new in order to add a new timer you will need to name the timer i will just call it timer nothing fancy just for the example and once you did you will need to set up an end date just like any other countdown plugin that we use so far all right, now we'll choose the parameters that will be displayed. For example, days, hours, minutes, and seconds, and the rest of the options are grayed out because it's the free version. Let's move on to the design tab. Here we can change the template. Uh, right now it's set to the default one. If you had a pro version, you can choose any other template. Excellent, so before we changing stuff, let's just see what it looks like. We'll click on update and we'll copy this shortcode add a Gutenberg block, the shortcode block, and we'll paste our shortcode here inside this block, and we'll update the page. We'll visit the page to make sure our countdown timer is there, and we can see it clearly over here, it looks really good. We definitely don't need the days, so let's uncheck this box, and we can also design each of the parameters separately. So let's change the color from blue to anything else maybe like pink or purple just like so and then i will update the shortcode refresh the page and this will be disappeared and this blue color will become pink just like so it's working as it's expected and it looks really good the next plugin we will explore called countdown with image or video background and this is a very unique plugin you can get it from the official Code Canyon page for $14 or from us for only $4.99. Again, that's the exact same plugin. You can also install it from our plugin manager. Just go to plugins for WP and here you'll be able to search for it, install it and then activate it. So once you activated the plugin, refresh this page and go to countdown with background into add new. Here you will need to enter a name for the countdown. I will just call it countdown, very simple, and click on add new. To see all the countdowns you already created, just go to manage countdowns. You will have the one you created along with the default one that came pre-installed. And this is the shortcode that we can use to display the countdown. So let's start by countdown settings. And I don't wanna go to the settings uh, too much because it's pretty similar to all the other countdown plugins that I showed you so far. They're all pretty similar. The uniqueness of this plugin is the playlist option for this timer. And let me show you what I'm talking about. So again, you have many options over here, but the one I would like to show you, it's the playlist. So over here, let's go to background playlist, just like so. And here we can add images to our playlist. So let's start by adding one image. For example, I will choose this car and click on add record and I will add another image just after that one. So right now the playlist is assembled by one image and I will add another one. And this time I will add this lasagna dish. There you go. And click on add. And now this playlist contains two images. So now I will copy the shortcode and will paste it inside any of our pages i will add a shortcode block and paste the shortcode here inside this block and once i updated it i can visit the page and the page was transformed into a maintenance mode or under construction mode 
and we can see the timer over here. And the nice thing is the images, the background images that changing and fading every few seconds. And of course, everything you can define inside the settings page. And the last plugin that I would like to show you in this video called Yet WooCommerce Product Countdown. And this plugin was specifically created for WooCommerce. You can get it uh, for full price from the official website or from us for only $4.99. Once activated, go to uh, Yet Countdown. And here you have a few tabs to customize the global settings of the plugin and the widget. But for now, let's leave it as is. I would like to show you the uniqueness of this plugin. Let's go to any of the products. And a new tab was added to the left bottom side called Product Countdown. Let's click on it and enable this countdown by checking this box. Here we'll choose an end date to the sale or whatever we are running, the promotion we are running. We also have the option to uh, set a uh, discounted product, but for now let's just see what the counter looks like. We will visit this page and we can see a beautiful counter just uh, above the product image, which is great. Now, again, we have the option to set a discounted product and that will encourage our visitors to act. So for example, we can say that there are only five products uh, on sale and after we'll sell these five products, the sale will be over. So right now we'll update the page and we can see another timer was added just below the original timer and it's showing on sale zero out of five sold. And if we would like to encourage them to act even faster, we can change the sold item to any other number. For example, four out of five items been sold and that will create them to act even faster, just like so. Just like all the other plugins, we can also change the global settings of this plugin from the Yeet tab. Let's go into it and here we can change uh, the function or the customization of this plugin. So right now we can change the style to style 2 or 3 and many other options, but for now this will do it. Uh, all you have left to do is just to scroll down, change whatever you want, colors, size, templates, etc. Save the changes and revisit the product page refresh it and you can see uh, the timer adopted the new settings all right guys so thank you once again for watching this video we went through some of the nicest countdown plugins for wordpress you have the full list in the written blog post definitely make sure to read it and check it out please also like the video share it with your friends and subscribe to our channel because there are more great videos on the way i will see you all in the next video